praise God because of one name, the name Jesus. Hallelujah. Sing his name, sing the name Jesus. Jesus, 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 name above every name. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Very good morning to anyone in Gillingham who's listening up. My name is Dominic, and uh, I have some wonderful news for you. Amen. Are you ready? Yes. For God so loved the world that he gave his, his only, only son, son, Jesus Christ, to die on a cross, that whoever believes in Jesus, whoever calls on the name of Jesus, will not ultimately die but we'll have everlasting life. Amen. My friends, the great news today as you live and breathe on this earth is that there is a God, that he loves you, that he created you, he knows everything about you, he knows what your name is, he knows how many hairs there are in your head, he knows your fears, he knows your anxieties, he knows your dreams. He knows you completely and he loves you completely. Amen. That's the absolute truth. You're not an accident today. This life, this earth is not some meaningless uh, cosmic ball bouncing through a universe. You're not a jumped up monkey, but you are created in the image and likeness of Almighty God. You are fearfully and wonderfully made. And God knows you, he loves you, he knows you by name. But the reason many of us don't know God, the reason this message even will be offensive to some and will mean nothing to others, is that sin has cut us off from God. Hmm. Our sin has made us enemies of God in our minds. So we don't know God. And this is true for 26 years of my life. It's true for, for many people. We live feeling alone. We live feeling isolated. We live and there's suffering and there's sickness and there's fear and there's depression and there's suicide. We live, my friends, in a cursed earth. This, this earth is cursed. It's broken. God didn't create it that way, but sin entered in and the earth is cursed. But God had a solution even from eternity for the problem we live in. God sent Jesus as redeemer, as savior, as healer. Jesus came to this broken earth to show us who God is. Jesus said, if you've seen me, you've seen almighty God. You see people in 2020 and even in 2021 have questions about life, understandably. We're in our third lockdown. Every day the newspapers are filled with statistics about people in getting this wicked virus, people dying. We live in a time of great shaking, a, great, a time of great fear. And as a result of that, people are asking questions. But my friends, the ultimate answer does not come from the scientists. The ultimate answer does not come from the journalists. The ultimate answer has been given to us by Almighty God in the person of his son, Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ came to this earth as savior of humanity. Jesus died on a cross. He took your yeah, sin, he took sure. my yeah, sin. Yeah, yeah. He took all of our sicknesses. He took all of our mental illness. He took every curse this earth has ever known onto his body at the cross. He was judged in our place. He died in our place. He went down into the lower parts of the earth in our place. And my friends, three days later, he rose from the dead and Jesus Christ is alive today. Amen. And you can know him. Amen. This is the good news of the gospel. It's it's not about us doing as many good deeds as we can, ticking a box on a Sunday and going to church. Some of those things can be good. But God isn't after our religion. He wants relationship with us. And the way we get relationship with God is we must repent, turn around, turn to Jesus, call on his name. 